Forest Society and Colonialism. Why deforestation? Deforestation is clearing Earth's forests on a massive scale. This has been existent since many centuries ago but under colonial rule, it became more systematic and extensive. Land to be improved. As population increased over the centuries and the demand for food went up, peasants extended the boundaries of cultivation by clearing forests. The British encouraged the production of crops like jute, sugar, wheat and cotton. The demand for these crops increased in 19th century Europe where food grains were needed to feed the growing urban population and raw materials were required for industrial production and trade. In the early 19th century, the British considered forests to be unproductive wilderness that had to be cultivated so that the land could yield revenue, and enhance the income of the state. Timber for the Tracks By the 19th century, oak forests in England were disappearing. By the 1820s, search parties were sent to explore the forest resources of India. Within a decade, massive quantities of timber were being exported from the forests of India. The spread of railways from the 1850s created a new demand. Railways were essential for foreign trade and for the movement of imperial troops. To run trains, Lumber was needed as fuel, and sleepers were vital to hold the tracks together. From the 1860s, the railway network expanded rapidly. As the railway tracks spread through India, a large number of trees were cut down. The British government gave out contracts to individuals to supply the required quantities. Forests around the railway tracks started disappearing hurriedly plantations. Large areas of forests were also cleared to make way for tea, coffee, and rubber plantations to meet Europe's increasing need for these commodities. 